Who is one celebrity nobody hates? Rick Moranis. Although he did get punched by some random. That guy probably wouldn't have if he knew it was him. Maggie Smith. The late Fred Rogers. Julie Andrews. Sir Ian McKellen. Brendan Fraser. Never heard an unkind word about him. Haven't heard a single complaint about his comeback. Even Leonardo DiCaprio apparently loves him because he was the only guy who never treated him like the new kid on the block. How did you find out you were getting cheated on? He pocket dialed me while bragging about it to a co-worker. The universe really had my back on that one. The guy shot me a message on social media. Said he was sorry and didn't know she was in a relationship. I bumped into him at a bar years later and bought him a drink. Open up the tablet to play with it. Found an open email that I had never seen before. Read the messages between them. I've never been the same since. Divorced now. We were together for 30 years. Edit. I am overwhelmed by all of your love and kindness. Thank you. Love back to all of you. Yes I tried and wanted to keep my marriage. But he continued to lie and betray me so that I was left with no choice but to divorce. Do you know what helped me so much? My mom, without asking or anything, came over and filled my freezer with crock pot meals and casseroles. I was so depressed and I had two children to care for. And dinner was always so easy just to pop in and be done with. She did that for about a year. Forever grateful for her thoughtfulness and generosity. Her roommates called and asked me to meet them for lunch. Said it was important. I met them and they told me she had been cheating on me with her ex the entire time I was deployed. They showed me pictures. Back when you had to get pictures developed. They said I was a good man and I didn't deserve to be treated like that. They had collected my things that morning when she left for work and gave them to me. I drove to her work. Walked up to her. Showed her the pictures and demanded the ring back. She gave it to me and I left. Later she called me yelling about me, conspiring with her roommates, basically trying to make it my fault. She asked what I was doing meeting with them. I said, it's called respect and closure and it sounds like this, I unplugged the phone. Landline. Waited an hour plugged in the phone and called the phone company. Said I needed to change my number and never heard from her again. I took it really rough and am thankful for her roommates and the friends that got me through. Probably the darkest time of my life. I didn't know at the time we broke up. For sure. But she was engaged a week after we broke up. I can't even figure out how that worked. Exactly. When she left me cause she got pregnant. And thought it was a different guy's. Turns out I was one of three possible dads. Couple years later and a few paternity tests and turns out it was mine. What does the Reddit community hate on the most? James Corden. Gender reveals. Reposts. Lately Twitter. Subscribe, my brothers.